Hello! I am Candy Bernard Bones. <laughs> Did you forget that was my name? Was it that long ago since I've been around you? The Bernard I forgot. Candy Bones I knew. Yeah, I don't usually say my middle name very often. That's fair. All right. Let's pick up where we left off last time. Where was that? Last time we had just finished uh, one of our first few quests, and we recently got sorted. We are Hufflepuff. Oh. Mobile live. Okay. okay, so Twitch, yeah, Twitch says we're live now. Oh, well, that's good. Otherwise, this would make me feel really silly. You make you feel really silly. I'm the one that's streaming this. <laughs> but I had to float all the way over here. That's true. You make no bones about that, though. Exactly. Okay. Do I remember where I'm going? No. But yeah, that would help. Otherwise, this would be like when I used to stream. After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Accio this, Accio that, cutlery flying everywhere. Quite unsafe, really. True. And I can actually use that spell. Accio. The one that makes Lewis. stuff float around? Kind of. That's Leviosa. I know that's the float spell, but like the one that you throw stuff around with. Yeah. Accio. No. There we go. Ah. Uh, so only specific objects in the environment react to that. Right. Like, for example, in real world, as far as Hogwarts is concerned, according to one of the other players in this game, apparently it mainly is meant for clothing. Huh? That's exactly what I said. I'm like, why? Oh, no. It would only work on clothing if you tried to do it on a person. Oh, right. <laughs> Four. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't right? you? Yeah. Hello. Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Hope your first day is going well. Yeah. Oh, as far as uh, story lore is concerned, we are a transfer student, fifth year. Okay. Is that like... Anyone who plays this, or do you select a backstory? That's the main story for the character itself. Ah, uh, okay. So yeah. that's across the board. Yeah, you don't get to Everybody technically... plays that character. Right. Because uh... some games that like to input a backstory. Or select from like two or three or sometimes five, depending on how far back you go. Oh, yeah? Well, yeah. Like, a lot of tabletop-based uh, RPGs were like that. Oh, like Boulder's Gate, perhaps. Yep. Stuff like that. That makes sense. Mm. Yeah, no, this one doesn't do that. Well, even Mass Effect does. I haven't played that one. Wait, what? I'm actually surprised you never played Mass Effect. That's one of the best games ever made. I've heard of it. The third one I was have Yep. Yeah, from what the I hear. The first one didn't age well, but it's still great. The second yeah. one was kind of the best. But it wasn't as good as the first one, ironically. But it's still a great series. Don't touch Andromeda unless you really like glitches. Wait a minute, wait a minute. The second one was the best, but it wasn't as good as the first. Wouldn't that make the first one the best? You just have to play it to <laughs> find out. Believe me, that makes perfect sense to those who actually played it. Okay. Um. <laughs> Let's see, you seem to hold your own in charms. Yeah, I know. But I'm not going to be a jerk. I've been fortunate. Beginner's luck. <laughs> My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Yeah, but you're a Ravenclaw. He tends to be overconfident in his. I think Eerie well, would be a Ravenclaw. Well, better see to my charms homework. I'm afraid I, can I see can't that. count on beginner's luck to impress I would be Professor Oak. Axum thinks he'd be Gryffindor. But no, I got him back to Slytherin to myself. I don't Honestly, think he'd like it if I said that. No, he wouldn't, but I mean, you're not wrong, to be completely honest. I'd say me and Dejra are both Hufflepuff. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Boing! Blattrick would just make his own up. <laughs> and then prank, and then fret, and then uh, promptly get expelled. Pretty no, much. No, no, Flattrick. But you should. Check out Eerie Clark. 
just Google it. You'll find all our stuff there. Yep. Shameless cross promotion. Did that suit of armor just move? I don't know, maybe. Hang on. I wasn't looking. I'm gonna walk past it again. Oh, it did. Oh, that one just did. Okay. Yeah, it did. Okay, good. So I'm not crazy. Open. Thank you. I'm glad you passed up the opportunity on that joke. Uh, but, but I dozed off for a second. <laughs> okay, let's see. Wait a minute. Rebellion. Mm, no, not going to tell me anything. Fine. Is the map? Nope. I don't remember what I'm doing. Let's check. Protego. The... Oops, wrong. Screen. Yes, please check the quest log or map or whatever you gotta check. Right. We don't want to get lost in small spaces again. Are you claustrophobic? No, but I am tired of doing that. Because in a lot of my playthroughs, I did that. And uh. in a lot of the games Eri played. He did that. Oh, right. I need to go to the Dark Arts class. Dark Arts, huh? Sounds like a fun little racing thing. Dark Arts. <laughs> that took a second. Where, where you race stars. Right. Yeah, maybe maybe beef would be in that. I love the fact that it gives you a map to tell you where to go. Cause you know me, I get lost with a map. So does Eri. Okay. I think you should hit the button prompt. There you go. Stupefy! Stupefy! You see him? Uh-huh. He's the one we need to watch out for. Okay. Speaking of... Look out! Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today, we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, Let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Hopefully not me. Nope, but now I have to learn the spell. Look, even my telekinesis that I used to float, I could probably just counter it. Hey, there we go. Levioso. Swing. That was Levioso. I agree. And no, it's Leviosa, now, let's not try Leviosa. Something a little larger. Yeah, whatever. You see what I did there? Yes, I know what you did there. Okay. I'm going to assume you actually know more about the Harry Potter universe than I do. A little bit. I've seen all the movies, at least. Same. And I've heard some ramblings about it. I've seen the movies, I haven't read the books. Let's just begin with a basic cast. Um... Oh. Right. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, 
than the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Leviosa. Good. Oh, that's interesting. Well done. Very good. But the best way to practice is by dueling. On guard. We'll start with you two. Duelists, take your marks. Oh Sorry God. For a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now we're starting I against Sebastian. This is going to be fun. Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Bring it. This is my wheelhouse, babe. Is it now? This should be like easy. A this can't be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. I do I want to join you, my duel. Oh, nice with this Killed it. I don't know. I think he's still Not alive. Bad for a Probably beginner. Again. You give yeah, as good, good as you get. <laughs> but I always win these competitions. It's the um. I put you on the spot shuffleboard and that you I'm not good at. The challenge. Points to Hufflepuff. I don't Thank remember you, what the Eckert. actual name of the Glad game the is, but you use the Accio spell to move balls If what I've seen today is any you. indication, we can expect <gasps> great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelow's entirely. Yeah, Understood pretty on the nose. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. How would you know? You Perhaps don't have Mr. a nose. Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. I used to! Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional well, assignments. you <laughs> 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 I love the look. <laughs> that was perfect. How did you do that without a tongue? Don't ask questions. Yeah, good point. Um, How oh. am I doing anything without muscles? Or without a brain, for that matter. Okay, um, intelligence not being tied to a physical brain. Here. Touche. <laughs> I was what? waiting for the quip. I'm like, okay, what? Nothing to say. <laughs> what quip? I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? <clears throat> it felt more like I was dueling an expert. Sebastian Sallow, by the way. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair <laughs> enough. You owe me an him, honest duel when you aren't. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive unsanctioned dueling organization. No response? Oh, wait, what? <laughs> I had to check my phone. Ah. Uh, he commented that this isn't my first time dueling. And I said, well, yeah, I've done this before. You're lucky I didn't hold back. And I said, I told him off, didn't I? Yeah, I'd say so. Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club, or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure mm. I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere I mean, unsanctioned. Pretty on brand we'll see if your series. performance today was sheer sure. luck or well, actual mean, skill. Look for Luke and Bradley near the clock tower entrance. Hermione if you're is one of those. Oh boy. She didn't want to get in trouble, but ended up getting in all of the trouble. Yeah. What's with Hermaeus Mora back here? 
What's with the eye things? That's what I just said. Is that what they're called? No, I was making a Skyrim reference. Oh, I barely played it. Huh. Are they alive? Do they feel pain? Do they know that they exist? Are they conscious? Do they feel anything? Like, physically? We Does shall, it hurt? We shall see. Oh, goodness. He needs to practice a bit more, I think. <laughs> What did she say? She said, oh goodness, I think you need a bit more practice. Shut up! NPC. I th think she was talking to me, but okay. My uh, <sighs> All I can say is thank Merlin right. to get school policy to let them in the car. Next. Oh. And no one's in the chat. But who's watching? If you're watching... Drop, drop a line in the chat down there, and I may or may not respond to it. I'll try to, though. Right? But yeah, talk to us. It'll be a lot more interesting if you give me material to bounce off of. Same here. That is the whole point of doing this live. Indeed. Weasley off the class. All right. And let's see, where am I going? Oh, Rose wrong button. Objects, wrong right button. Where's the... Oh, right. Alt. Oof. Sitting at zero views right now. That's normal for me, unfortunately. But God willing, that won't always be the case. I mean, I usually used to have at least a few people on at a time. Well, we all have to start somewhere, don't we? But when I started, I had like five people at a time. You're not helping. <laughs> I'm not criticizing you. I'm criticizing Twitch. That's fair. I mean, I've also heard rumors that Twitch won't always be here. Yeah. Yeah. When I get back to streaming, I'm probably what about not going to do it on Twitch. Professor? Deke! I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. I remember him. He is so adorable in this game. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. Ah, there you are. The good news is, unlike Dobby, Deke is actually, I trust shall we your say, first classes went well? They a did, free professor. elf. I heard as much oh, from see. Professors Hecate and He already Roman. got his sock, if Seems you know what professor I mean. Right. taught you quite a bit <laughs> before you arrived. I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't I really there? wish they had gotten McGonagall's actress for this, but that probably would have been too much to ask. Probably. Huh? I'd wager. Th Is that you or me? No. Me. I I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels than what you. Well, yeah, but at the same time, I'm not supposed to tell her that, so. Nothing more, Professor. I see. Like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Thank you. Uh, do -do -do. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned Thank earlier. Thank you. I was about to ask about that. We've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Excellent. Oh, so it's like, this is where you get your custom one? Custom? Slightly. Ah. I mean, there are a few options, although I wager... I've heard rumors there's a mod to where you can actually have your character wield the Elder Wand. <laughs> which is hilarious. Um, do, 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 do. What about the potion shop? What's the spellcraft? I'm already good. I need to... I, I, just, let's just go. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. 
I've noticed you spending time with them. You've played Fable. Oh, yeah! The original Fable. A little bit. Okay. Because... Huh? What? First time chat. Who's this? Hey, man. Following you already to help you reach 50 followers. I'll love you back. Sure. Sure, why not? Thanks for commenting. Still watching, right? Since we got one. Right? Might as well chat and hang out with us for a while. Absolutely. I won't always be here. Yeah, I'm a special guest. So I want to make use of him while I can. Yep! As for following you, I will once I'm done here. Just help me remember. Because I might forget by accident. Sure thing, sure thing. <laughs> Talk to us! Say words. And I may respond to. It's a lot funnier when people do that. Right? Um, so, what? Since I'm a Hufflepuff, I'm going to say, let's talk to Natty. I'd like to go with Natty. Excellent choice. Miss Onai is one of our most talented students. And she knows the area. She'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Who's Rowling's that? assignment, your I friend will meet you at the castle honest. doors. No I've time only to waste. played this game once. The sooner you complete your work, the I've sooner played it you can never. have a butterbeer at the three books. That's fair. And I will say for what it's worth, one thing I love about this game, you don't have to have any knowledge of the universe to actually have pl to play it. Right, because it teaches you everything you need to know as you do it. That too. I mean, my point is that you don't have, like, for example, you eventually get to ride a hippogriff, whatever that is. You don't know what a hippogriff is. That's not a Harry Potter specific thing. Come again? That's not a Harry Potter specific thing. That's a basic mythological beast. Oh. It's kind of like a griffin. I just know that they're fun to ride. They are. Am I crazy or did that plant just change shape? Yeah. You just answered your own question. Okay, can you I can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Cute. Okay. Um, the reason I ask about Fable, and I'm going to phrase this very carefully. The woman who voices this character we're about to talk to, oops. Not him, the other person. They sound almost identical. And it makes me wonder if it was the same person, but I'm not sure. Possible. Ah, there you are. Oh, I like this guy. He is hilarious. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do. And an exceedingly useful one at that. Repero. The mending charm, Repero. Fixes things right up. Makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching you spells outside of class in an effort Man, to catch you up with your you that spell. A number you of you professors have agreed stream. to do so as well. But Ironically, first, when I hear each shall spell, ask my brain that you complete a few vibes. preliminary tasks to hone your magic. I have arranged some for oh, today. Yeah. See them through yeah, and then report that. back to me. We will have you casting Ropero in no time. <laughs> I can I can practically see the wheels spinning. <laughs> wheels. Oh, look at it. Okay. <laughs> I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Oh, great! My nose is starting to itch. Whoa! 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 Get back here. Akio. What are you doing? There you are! That's what I wanted. And there's like 50 of those pages floating around the world. Ah, oh, I see, I see. Because that book I'm carrying, when we got that book, it opened up and a boatload of pages just went... That sounds like fun. 
yeah, it's a cheeky way to get you to actually go around the world and actually do stuff. Um... Did that do anything? I reckon Sebastian did not. This is the right area. I wonder where the flying page is. Oh, I've got to go hunt it down. Revenia. Am I not close enough, I guess? I don't know. Are you? It's within distance. I'll see it. Wait a second. I keep wanting to. There's a cat. Huh? Oh There's yeah. A cat. You can pet the kitty. Best game, ten out of ten. I knew you of all people would get a kick out of that. Of course. Oh, I'm an idiot. What's up? Wait. Rebellion. What the? Okay, I thought I saw it. Saw so what? I thought I saw the page I needed. Uh. Am I really supposed to be hunting for a page? Hang on. What are you supposed to be doing? Professor, collect the flying pages near the broken step. Oh! Yes, I'm an idiot. That's this quest. Once you finish it, you learn the spell. Okay, so go to the broken statue. Revenia. Is it not nearby here? It might not be. Oh, 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 You should look at the map at the bottom left hand. Oh, there it is. Where? It's right in front of you. Turn around. You can't keep going. Other way. Rebellion. The opposite of where you're looking. There you go. Akio. That's stuff on the ground. That's the broken statue. Gotcha. Got it. That's my problem. I'm blind. Well, not completely, but yeah. A flying page must be around here somewhere. I'm a diagnosis away from being legally blind. Might some kind soul help me? Yes, I'll help you, but later. I have other things to do right now, dear. She wants me to go find her... Uh... Stones of some kind. Stones! She plays a game. Uh -huh. If only a new student would to help me with my sad predicament. Akio! Brilliant! Unfortunately, that wasn't the page I was looking for, but there's eight. There are six more floating around the. Awesome. Okay. Where am I going? That's a door, not a wall. What help if you paid attention? Oh, it would also help if the map didn't try and lead me back to the professor. Oh, uh, yeah, that can get confusing. The other one is near the Dark Arts. I have an idea. What happened? Teleport. Uh, yeah, use that fast travel when you can. Yeah, that's what I just did. See? I am affirming. Okay. Rebellion. Said it was near here somewhere. Uh, 
because... Oh. I already caught the other one, I guess? Well, that's annoying! <laughs> Okay, I feel stupid. I apparently already had the other page. So yeah, we did need to go back to the professor. I trust the preliminary tasks. I completed the assignments, professor. Marvelous. You clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Reparo! I wonder if the Switch version has motion controls for that. I would certainly hope so. And is it just the joystick? Uh, That's it. Very good. Be doing all that with if that you would like to practice mending something, yeah, have a you go would. With that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. <laughs> okay. In which case. You remember where that statue was earlier? Um, been to the kitchen. Kinda. I hear it's run by oh, yeah, through there. No, not there. Revelia. Uh, opposite way. Oh yeah, it's over here. Wait, is it? No, 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 the other way. The other way. Well, I mean. What I'm aiming for. What the heck? That way. The direction you're going. Yeah. Yeah, that way. Not in there! It's right here. The blue thing. The other blue thing. It's not that one, I don't think. It's over there. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. It's back here. That arch yeah, that you know one. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Listen to me next time. Repairer. Is it? Akio. No, not Akio. Nope, not this one. Really? That would be doing something, if it were. Or, are you trying to fix a thing? Yes. Then go to the one that's actually broken. That's not the broken statue. To your left. Oh! That's the broken statue. Nicely done. Works like a charm, doesn't it? <laughs> Smart ass. What's that mean? Intelligent rectum. Ah. Uh. Oh. <laughs> you pronounced it so weird. I used the same um, accent they did. It sounded like you said small toss. That's what it sounded like you said. I'm like, what? Okay, I'll put it in American. I said smart arse. Oh, yeah. Yeah, smart I get arse. it now. It took me a second. But you pronounced it all weird like. Are you saying my pronunciation is weird? Yes, yes, I am. Well, then. Pavelia. You're lucky I can't cast a Vada Kedavra yet. It would just ricochet off of me. Or blast you to pieces. Um, I am a Grim Reaper, one of many in case you forgot. Mm. So a Vada Kedavra, like... 
It's like a call. That would be a calling sign for me if I was in that universe. <laughs> <laughs> that, would just be, that would just be like a buzz on my pager. Yes, in the other world, we actually still have those. Nice. Okay. I forgot where I'm going. Okay. Welcome to Hogsmeade. Oh. Let me see, do I have that flu? No. Nah, because that'd be too easy, wouldn't it? Do you know what you're doing? Yes. Alright. We are going to hugs me. I'm actually amused it let me jump the stairs like that. Bonk. What's ironic is I've actually used a mod to increase the player's speed, and it's still not that much quicker. Hello. Oh, really? Natty. Now tell me if she doesn't sound like uh, whisper. Not at all. Professor Weasley tells me that you need to go to Hogsbeat. You wow, must be eager that to have does your own so things again. Yeah. And to see the village. I've been looking forward to it. Good. <laughs> Shall we set off? I intend to give you a first rate but at the same time, now that I think about it, it's, she also sounds like, um. Oh dear. Um, I'm having a brain fart. And dropping your mic. Yeah, I know. What's the zebra Oh, Zakora! Thank you. Voiced by Brenda Crishlow. I, I couldn't have told glad you that Professor much. Weasley asked me I to could the because news. eerie matter. Really? Yes. Nice. I to extend yep. an invitation it was to you myself. Convention. I thought you might enjoy a better be in the village. She was kind of the life of the whole party. <laughs> the timing of Professor Weasley's owl was perfect. Out of curiosity, is she from Uganda? I don't think so. Oh, because her because this person's character <sighs> is. I cannot tell you how so nice it is to breathe might have fresh been the air after being cooped up in ancient rooms. I think she's just from Narnia. Grave mistake to take it as an elective class. Believe me. If I remember correctly, I believe you. I'm not sure. Though she's I a Cajun. You would not really call it think so. Elective when your mother was the one who elected. Brenda is. Different. I mean, interesting. I'm pretty sure. I wouldn't tell. I wouldn't Hogsmeade know. Hogsmeade is beautiful this time of year. Everyone will tell you to visit at Christmas. I still want to meet but Tara one of, one of these days. that's times of year I would rather be in. Good luck on that. Right? Not much for the cold, are you? Oh, I don't even I know if she still does so much, uh, cons or not. It has taken some getting used to. I did not grow up around so I know snow. a lot of voice actors that worked on MLB stopped doing cons because of the cons. Oh, wait. Over here. Which is ironic because you I think for Terra they would be her strong area. suit. Oh, what's so special about them? <laughs> they are interesting to look <laughs> at. <laughs> and can also use them in potion making. Riku should steal that joke from you. Riku? Riku! From Final Fantasy X? Yeah, I was she did like. her too! Terra Strong was, was Riku in Final Fantasy X. How am I? I had to have remembered that at some point. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you and Eerie talked about it at one point. Yeah, I mean, well, for one, Look, that's one of my favorite games. I would have, I would have known that. Hippogriff. Yeah. I wonder if something's. Yeah, oh, there's the hippogriff, by I the way. I heard rumors that hippogriffs had been spotted nearby. The two white ones. I see it. And she would, by the way. Would what? Have used that joke. Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? Then again, Absolutely. so would Waka. Likely already named them. That's the forbidden forest on the left. 
It's oh, I also found out dance. something. <laughs> As What's the up? name implies. In one of the Teenage Mutant Ninja limits? Turtles movies, the professor like came it is too dangerous. Yeah. Trying to remember, I think, I think it was Leonardo. Only makes it more alluring. Um, I say knew uh, when it was from 2007. Over the crest. Pass but um, me. he played Leonardo, uh, James Arnold Taylor. I was played Leonardo. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, same guy that did Tetris. Yep. The Ratchet, Professor and he did the same the exact air. voice that he Since did for Ratchet. Nice. Siri had a total nerdgasm on that one. Ooh. You know, James Arnold she Taylor also voiced Obi Wan. I will say. Oh yeah, in well, what? I, I can't remember. The uh, Clone Wars micro series. Oh yeah, yeah, that's Wars. right. I think he does him in the other Clone Wars series, but I don't remember. How are you settling in? I don't think so. I remember the weeks that followed my arrival. Pretty sure that was a different strange. guy. I don't know. Everything I'd have to look. Was so yeah. But I know for a fact it was him in the micro I'm series. I'm getting used to things. What about you? Do you finally feel settled? And in August, moment. Tom but Kenny is, is going to be at an Oklahoma convention. I'm getting out of the castle and oh, yeah. trying to yep. adjust quite a bit. Right here in Tulsa. Hogwarts has become something SpongeBob's coming to Tulsa. Hopefully and Spyro. Oh yeah. He did Spyro yep. two, well, three, and reignited. Run. He did the He's originals. The caretaker. Looks they got a, a different voice actor for Reignited, from what I was told. No, he was the one that did all of Reignited. The very first game was a totally different guy. I can't remember his name. Ah. But he did Hello, um, Have you two and three, three originals. Pleasure. But he reprised um, the roles for the remix. Uh, nice. Turn and yeah. Run. Is everything all right? Oh no, we've got a transformer. Right at me. Uh, I'm gonna so a what did Mr. Before I leave, maybe we can keep it rolling, but I'm going to break the magic for a second because Dougie I need to do some adjustments. Mm. Yeah, that's fine. I, I Also, with the stream, I don't know how to pause. Good luck to both of you. Uh, you hit the be right back button, but you don't oh, need to do that. It's empty, guys. I think it's <sighs> too much fun in the village. I will say that I well, never I mean, seen at some point, I do need to make a hotkey for that anyway. See, this is what I should have done in the village. Oof. See, now he's out of frame. I was gonna say he's not in frame, though. <laughs> you gonna be digging into my shoulder. <laughs> I wouldn't try to do that. I was focused way more on trying to get him. Which is a good thing, because my shoulders aren't as meaty as they used to be. Really to, there. Okay, so just don't, there is much just don't to see outside of the castle way. walls, not just Hogsmeade. I am happy to explore whenever you'd like. Rumors being what they are about goblins and such, it might be nice to have a friend with okay. you. Okay. <laughs> There's no way I can do this without smacking him. The sun. Hmm. And here we are. I have a Harry Potter wand somewhere around this house. Broomsticks is the place for I got it in a mystery box. And you can get any sweets you can imagine at Honey Duke's. I could not choose a favorite shop here. It changes with every visit. I can tell you that you are certain to find everything. I saw a thing online where somebody had made had taken a had basically jury rigged Professor a little thing Weezy to said that you need to get flash paper recipes, to make it look like you can cast a spell out of it and a new wand of course you will enjoy mr all right Amanda. am i back I'm keen to see oh this is way better yeah way you better. Be able to okay you need and you're just in time. time we're about to get our wand as well oh yeah experience hugs me at your own pace we can meet up in the town circle when you are finished yeah conveniently in time enjoy for our yourself. first problem i will see you soon all right then but, yeah, I'm not going to spoil that. Hogsmeade, I know. That's fine. Is this not where I want to go? And I don't have the Alohomora charm, so I can't open it. Oh, wait a minute. What's that? That's what they were trying to tell me. What's that? I need to use this map. For what? To know where I'm going. Oh. Well, do it and go there already. I'm over here. I want to go here. Can I mark you? Oh, yes. Set a waypoint. Mm -hmm. 
Ollivander! I'll be right with... Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. He knew uh, to expect me. Hello, sir. I'm looking for... Oh, are you supposed to, anyway? Yes. It's about time. Yes, I... About time. Normally, well, like, you're our new fifth year student, are you? Know? Come to him oh, and, what uh, am I saying? Of course you are. I already do. Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Alabanders, I'm sure. Store. Finest one makers oh. in the world. They come in to it's pick a up pleasure what they to meet you. Oh, what someone Truly. For them. Now, come with me. I Let's find you the perfect just shot one, here, my understanding. I don't know uh, about making an order no, because no, he's hunting. No, right? not you. Yeah. Um, ah, yes. They get custom made, and then they yes. get sorted. Mm. And then when he finds the one that belongs to you, he Ten gives it to you. Inches? But he doesn't choose the one. The wand chooses you. Yeah, give this one a try. Uh, maybe I got it all mixed up. Then. See, look, he's having me test this well, one, but this ahead, isn't the swish. one that we're gonna use. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Heads up! Oh dear. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? See. <laughs> uh, um. Uh, I got that we'll entirely something nice. not to worry. Mm. No, not you. Uh, uh, mm. Perhaps. Yes. How is our Around one viewer doing down three there? Quarter inches is that with us? String? You listening? Are we in another tab Let's give on this one a try. Or what? Um, talking to you. It looks like we still have one viewer. All right. Well, what's the use of it? Oh goodness! Warrior Looks like it's back to the shelf. Warrior you. mangoes. No, 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 Manco. This is proving to be Manco. trickier than I had anticipated. Like man company. How perplexing. Um. Well, I can't read that from over here. Perhaps you. Oh, you don't have peripheral vision uh, either. No. There you are. Yes. Nice touch, I by think the way. you might be <laughs> the one. Here, take it. Okay, so I think this is the one we're gonna pick, and now I get to play around with it, kind of. Ah, uh, you can customize it. The look of it. Kind of. Not really, yes, but indeed. eh. So it's just a stick. Basically, I'm gonna make a black one. Oh, maybe not. Um, yes, I want twisted. you. How intriguing. Dark brown, green gray, ash brown. No. I like the green gray. And for heart strength. Okay. I want a long wand. Curious I indeed. want... Long. And I want... How intriguing. And this is like really, really in depth for that. And of course, the Phoenix Feather. Ah, Phoenix Feather. Exceptionally rare and a core with a strong sense of initiative. What do you think? Extraordinary. <laughs> another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. <laughs> and to my amusement, I later learned after playing this for the first time, now, it don't matter how what did you that pick. feel. Good. Different. I mean, I'm not too I surprised. Sort of but I don't surge of some that's kind. A match. With the, Your connection seemed particularly you think, powerful. But it's literally the right just wand aesthetics. We'll learn from you just as you huh. learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. Of course. And the Phoenix Feather Core is like terribly selective. This will be an excellent match indeed. 
and the bond between you be and your wand different. should only grow stronger. That's Disney canon. Do not be surprised that makes my head hurt. Your new wand's ability to perceive your yes. intentions, particularly uh, in a moment of need. Wait a minute. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Olivander. Is that Disney canon? I'll let you get to it. Yes, Do in come the original and see me canon, again. Hyper crystals were can basically meant to resistance. augment your connection to the Force, but they could only do so within a certain radius. I thought that's what I meant. No. Because otherwise, let's put it this way, if you had a wand with a kyber crystal, you'd only be able to use it within a certain location. The farther you get from that location, the less powerful the wand would be. I'm confusing myself. Hmm. Quite. I just got a hat. I see this. Now the question is, am I supposed to pick up my supplies before he comes, or...? Oh, it should be coming around the mountain, though. No, he comes straight through, but that's neither here nor there. You are locked. I'm not going in there. Um... Let's go back to the map. Go to the world map. Let's go to the Hogsmeade map. And I want. Come on. Come on. No, I don't want you. Um. Pippins, that's what I wanted. Now, where is your waypoint? There you are. Around the corner. Kind of. Can I get in there this way? I don't think so. Wow. Well, I guess that's one way. Not quite what I meant to do, but it worked. I guess. Welcome to J. Pippin's Potions. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this he makes is the Irish Jay Pippin's me. potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. Mm -hmm. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. True. As it's your first time in, oh. I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all the manner of uses. Back. And I Oof. unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. Bastos. This gets a bit tedious at times. Uh, it's tedious just watching it. So what's all this stuff even do? You know what? Screw it. I'll come back and do this on my own time. Um, the different potions, some of them come in handy for um, in-game options. Certain things come in handy for it, like that Thunder Brew. That, uh -huh. that comes in handy later. The invisibility potion, obviously. Yeah. 
you get around that way. Revenia. I want to check and see if there's any pages flying about. No, not within range at least. Alright, um, no! Whoa! What? Okay, this is the first time I've seen this with my new graphics card. That water looks amazing. So it didn't look like that before? It didn't look that good, no. Huh. Well, I went from a 2070 to a 3070. Ah. And again, I want to make sure I'm going the right way. Spindwich, no. Where's the one I want? Looks made square. No. That's the one I want. Oh! And conveniently, I was right next to it. Well, hello there! Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. I'm actually oh, amused the destiny for that. the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you, then. Merlin's well, I mean, beard. you of all people should know Starting my short term is as a fifth year. You yeah. must be positively Something reeling like from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. I will say for what oh, it's bravo. worth, the planting in this Not game is the kind of fun. to take things as is they it? come. Kind of. Timothy but then again, I do have a way. And this is my thing shop, for botany the magic neep. I keep the cart out here because I'm not a chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. Oh, in to ironically, seeds, I no, I haven't played plants. that one. Grow everything myself. But then again, I got burned out on that idea Even after playing Farmville for years. Well, what's oh, yeah, your yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let me guess, Although, for what it's worth, let me put fresh. it this way. Farmville did have its uses. I met one of my best friends that way. Plenty of oh, yeah. To pique your her interest, name was Pat. Oh, yeah. Remember, I think I talked about her at one point, remember? You probably did. We actually met in person at back when I was at Reazers. Good news is there's not nearly as much to pick up here. Yeah. Gameplay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, that said fluxweed. My brain read flaxseed. Yeah, those are different things. True. One actually exists in our world. Fluxweed, yeah. fluxweed to my knowledge, does not. No. But it does sound like something uh, stoners wouldn't have. Fluxweed. That would be the ones that try to time travel. Or at least think they do for a short time. Yeah, once they have 88 bongs per hour or something. Yikes. <laughs> How do you go through that? I'm not going to try to go through the logistics of that. Uh, I'm trying to remember, I think is the, this is the other one I want to go to. <clears throat> Visit Tomes and Scrolls. Yes. Oop, 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 oop. I want you. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, I don't care. I can swim. You gotta get your uh, robe all wet. Where'd you go? That's lame. Clothes are as dry as dry can be. In Final Fantasy 15, your clothes actually get wet if you fall in water. Yeah. 
And that came out before this. I mean, you could argue we use prestidigitation to dry ourselves off. That's what I wanted. Akio. Press the one now. Oh, right. My bad. Prestidigitation is D&D. Uh-huh. I still don't know what that is. Prestidigitation is a spell that has a boatload of different uses, depending on how creative you can be. Uh, one of them is to dry yourself off when you get wet. Which I actually made liberal use of in one of my campaigns I'm in right now, actually. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. Ooh, what do we got here? Did I actually get anything from it? Yes, I got some goggles. Okay, um... Did I somehow take a wrong turn? I don't know, did ya? I guess I got distracted looking at that chest. There we go. An inquiring mind. Indeed. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward now, to that Now, whether this Professor and Weasley I is any seen it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom Potter pieces series. of furniture no, I don't or the But she, I shall let Professor Weasley she, do the teaching. Whoever. For now, let's oh, get right. the spellcrafts you, you need. I a potting this table Did and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. I wasn't paying attention Nothing to like me. being able to grow no. your own ingredients like and do what you points. want when you That's want. That's fair. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? If you're and I'll go buy the rest later. Feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Well, that's everything. Better go and find that's Natty. That's not a flying page. Matt, I was wondering what that blue thing was. So was I. Okay. Meet Natty at the town circle. Yep, this is where he shows up. That's what I was waiting on. We're about to get into one heck of a fight. Dooby 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 doo. Hello, Natty. Natasi. I have everything. I see what you meant about not being able to pick a favorite shop. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Something's going down. Yup. We got a troll. Exactly. Just like, chewing up like, hey, I'm about to wreck your mess, yo. Make a mess of what you got. Draw it away from the building! Away from the village! Well, good. so much for that. Duck! I am so glad it gave me enough time to do that. Duck! 
I am literally using the basic cast, and that's all I can do. Yeah. What Bomb. Was that? I was trying to beat him at his own game. Schwing. Get him. Get him. Schwing. Look, his fortune. Schwing. Took him long enough. Or we need to make sure he stays that way. Yeah, that's true. Oh, right. Yeah, you gotta find him. Tap into ancient magic, babe! Goodness! A second troll! Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard! Are you alright? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, Officer. Singer. Officer Singer. We just conveniently and learned thank you. the repair Again. spell. Right. Good way to put it to are use. Are you okay? Well, since you're okay, and you just did all that by yourself, Repera. I'm gonna put your ass to work. Uh, uh, right? A moment, if you would. Does that make sense? For well, at least they're not trolling. No, I didn't say anything about me. Kinda neat. You have a mini boss, and then you use a spell to put everything back together after the fact. That is kind of neat. Akio. Oh, thank God! I finally remembered how to do that. Because now I can change my spells out. Uh huh. Problem is, as you can tell, most of the good spells are locked. Right. Because you've got to learn those. Right. Repero. Ah, good as new. Did that actually accomplish anything? It wasn't pointed at anything, so no. You have to have a thing highlighted like that. Lucky they didn't do more damage. No, that's what happens when I don't. Delayed reaction? Oh, thank you, Natasi. Huh. The other girl was you helping. Go through that door, I thought. You know, I think you're right. That's where the way marker was. We were just talking about you. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothier Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Oh. Life saving. You were talking about the concept of. And as uh, I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. These stupid wardrobes they make you wear. Ah, I see. Thank you, Mr. Hill. Like That's one of them has these really of goofy it's glasses. The best I can do. They are amazing. Now, now let's they try look this so on stupid, side, shall we? I think that's part of the immersion. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. You've received a new piece of gear. Time to equip it. Well, thanks for giving me the option. It's still in tutorial mode. Yeah. Select the cloaks and ropes. You're impressed. Oh. Well, that happened, I guess. Yeah.
Okay. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butter beer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Fun fact, Sounds I like actually have a couple it. of recipes Wonderful. to make butter beer. Just down this way then. Oh, neat! Maybe at some point you can come over and we can make some. Battle-worthy items. That would be cool. Should you be inclined? The trick is going to be getting my hands on some of the ingredients because some of the ingredients are your a bit spicy. Ah, I see. For example, butterscotch snobs. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet the room. Is it? The owner. She is a charming hostess. I mean, and how many shops have you been to? to? Good one well, to my best shop closed, so I have to go to a different place now. There's like tons of them in the area. There's two within distance that I'm comfortable driving. Well, maybe we'll have to take you around and check and go buy some stuff. You might at that. Actually, no, there's three I can get to. Um, anywho. I think that's actually where I'm going to end this one. Because I just realized what time it is. And I've got to be at work in less than 12 hours. Yeah. Something like that. Yup. So. <sighs> In the words of Andrew Lloyd Webber, I hate to have to cut the fun short. What was that from? Phantom of the Opera. Oh. But it be what it be. Bye! I'm going to at least save my game. Because the good thing is now I can actually do so manually. I can remember how to do it. Oh. And then just as a backup in case this one crashes, because I've had that happen before. Huh. Alright, and that takes care of that. And now I can... Oh. Is it delaying on me, or is it stuck? Doesn't matter. No. I'm about to close it anyway. Yeah, good point. End stream. Oh, sorry. End stream.